Welcome to another Magic the Gathering Arena video. We are playing a draft today. I uh, didn't play much draft, uh, to be honest, I did a draft earlier, but it was horrendous. It was my first uh, uh, Theros limited experience at all, uh, ever. And uh, I went one and three and the one win was just because my opponent conceded for whatever reason. I don't know why. So I'm not releasing that video. That was like embarrassing. I drafted like an is it flash deck, like the second uh, when you cast a card on your opponent's turn theme, but it didn't work out at all this archetype. So uh, let's try another one. Well, this is surely a bomb. Uh, I have to mention I am always rare picking if I don't have all the copies of the card yet and this is surely a bomb that can win the game on its own. Grey Merchant is of course also a bomb but I want to build around Hakdos here. I'm not splashing black, especially not Devotion if I have to cast red, red, white, white. Uh, but Archon of the Falling Stars is also quite a strong card I think. Uh, it's expensive, but I'm taking it. Karametra's Blessing is quite good. It's even, uh, in the worst case, a one mana 2 2 trick. But it also gains uh, Hexproof and Instructable if it's. I mean, I can't save Hactos mo uh, most of the time and this Archon either. It's not surely not a third pick, I think. I think I'd rather take Birth of Miletus here. It ramps me at the very least. Oh yeah, this is a very good card, I think. Although I can't really enchant Hactos, but it's a uh, four mana deal four damage to target creature or planeswalker. Uh, the Hero of the Winds, though, is really good in, in Boros as well, so I'm not sure which one to take. I kind of want to prefer removal, though. And let's see. Yeah, this is a very good trick, I think. Oh, we get... Oh, wow. Hero of the Nyxborn? Sure. <laughs> uh, I think this is a much better draft already than the whole three packs that I had in the first draft. Uh, fixing would be nice for Hactos already. Should I try Furious Rise? I have r many cards with power 4 or greater, especially with pump effects. Kind of want to try it. Not sure if I will play it, but it has high potential. This is another here one. Yeah, I think I take this and this works nice with Furious Rise. I think I just take the frill here. I guess I take the uh, Slaughter Priest, but I probably won't play unless I splash a third color, which I really don't want to do with the mana cost on Hactos. Yeah, I guess I get this, I'm not sure. Field of Ruin. Yeah, I think I take the Sword. Not, does not work with Hactos, but it's nice in Boros, I think. Uh, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah, I'm surely rare picking. This is my fourth Thassa. I'm, I'm using an overlay to show. tell me that. Um, not playing her. Although, she only needs... Maybe I'm playing her. Let's let's keep her in here for now. Uh, Elsate is amazing. 
El Sade is amazing. I don't think I want the second birth of Melitas. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm getting Triumph of Annex. Final Flare is quite good, but I don't really want to sacrifice creatures, really. So this overlay tells me this card sucks. And this is way better. I guess this is removal. But I kind of like this. It's very aggressive. I kind of want to play aggressive here. Yeah, the omen is great. Oh, they are, they are both omen in, in color. But the red omen is surely better. Wow, I get so great cards. I have uh, another Iro's Blessing and Heroes of the Revel. I think I take the Heroes of the Revel here. And another Heroes of the Revel. Yeah, I'm taking them. And another one. What is this draft? Uh, yeah, this is much better draft than the other one. Yeah, and I'm Underworld Serage Hound. Sure pick here. Uh yeah, Omen of the Sun, I think. Not sure if I if I even play it. Yeah, the hero, I think. And fly final flare wield. Oh my goodness. Uh hero. Yeah, there's no need to splash a color. I, I'm not playing the slaughter, slaughter priest, and I don't think I'm playing Thassa. Uh, Sentinel and Ice is pretty good because it's ex escape for one uh, white and only two cards. Um, here I kind of want to take another, this is the fourth Heroes of the Revel, but I'm rare picking. And this is not bad, it's a 3 mana 3 2 haster, so I might actually play it. The hoplite is not all that great because I'm mainly red. But what else should I take here? I think the removal of the hero of the pride are probably better. I think the removal here. I already have two heroes of the games. Don't need another one. This is a great devotion enchantment creature, but I don't need either of those. I mean, this is a great card, but am I splashing green for that? I doubt it. So I think I just take another Sentinel's Eyes. Revoke Existence is not too bad to even main deck this. Oh, Triumphant Surge is still better. This is better removal. Can I see how many enchantments I have? Hmm. This is not the greatest Boros card, but it's still a 3 mana 3 4 with upside. So I think I take it. Making cuts in this deck will be very hard for an aura card. It's only 3 mana 1 2. And I don't have the gra greatest auras here. Two Sentinels' eyes. Uh, well, I can get the Dreadful Apathy. Aspect of Manticore. Oh, there are several ones. Do I... I put it into hand, not on top of the deck. I guess I take it. Yeah, here I think I just take the Karametra's Blessing. It's just such a good card.
What is the curve here? Do I take the Dream Shaper Shaman? I think I just take the Omen of the Forge and go full aggressive. Yeah, sure. I think I just take the Soul Guide Lantern. I probably won't play it. My, my pool is too good. Although, no, I think I take the Envoy. I have several um, Aura cards. I'm not sure if I even play it. I don't think I need another Hero of the Games. Especially as I have so many cards in this uh, free mana slot. Let's take the Soul Guide Lander, but I probably won't play it. Okay, this is a great draft. I think this might be a very good draft. Uh, Boros, Aggro. So, I don't think I even play the Archon, honestly. I should win before that. The three mana slot is, I'm not playing the Frill. The three mana slot. Is so I don't think I play the white omen. Birth of Miletus is not great. If it would be any land, but only planes. I just go full aggro here. This saves stuff, this saves stuff. <clears throat> this pump stuff and can, I can get it back. This pump stuff. It's probably too bad to play. Let's put this maybe in the maybe pile. Uh, it's a flyer and auras cost less. So how many auras do I have? Five. Not sure if that is worth. This is also in the maybe pile. This is a very good aggressive card. This is very good. This is very good. This is in a maybe pile because as well with the auras. Uh, yeah, I think I will play these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a very good trick. Kind of want that removal. Kind of want to try both out, just how good they are. Both uncommon cards, they are very situational. Uh, yeah, I'm not playing this one, I think. Two removals here. Yeah, I think this is a great thingy. So I think I cut here even two lands. Ooh, is this too aggressive? 15 lands. I don't think I can play only 15 lands. Certainly. Uh, let's still remove all the lands here and get the good looking ones. I think I play 16 lands. It's not too aggressive. I have five free five drops. Mm -mm -mm. I 
I'm considering cutting one of those two, especially as the free, um, as the free. This I have too many free drops. But I actually, how many creatures do I have? Twelve only. Yeah, I'm. I think I cut the Furious Rise and try the Triumph of Annex. Okay, so let's get the burn here and done. Yeah, I'm expecting like at least three wins here. I think this is a very good deck, much better. I knew the other deck that I drafted, the Is It Flash one, sucked and it's indeed sucked. Yeah, this is a keep. Please play a creature with two toughness. Please. Please, please, please. Yes. Amazing. Yeah, what I, I did a mistake. I should have played this one first. Okay. I think I go aggressive. I'm not keeping this up here. So, this is only enters the battle, has only an end of the battle field effect, okay. Yeah, so I will definitely do this, because then this gets an effect, and then I can attack. This is so good! Uh, and the turn, if I have this open, if not, I can scry. Sure. Oh, this is on each combat, okay. Sure. Nothing I can do. Pump it, yes! Yes, resolve. Yes! Oh my goodness, so good! <laughs> now he's dead. Oh, Hakdos, but I can't cast him. Oh my goodness, this was so good. I was so happy that he was pumping.
kind of sad that I'm now in silver, as I will probably get stronger opponents. Yeah, I have to mulligan this. Ooh, that's not great either. Oh, that's sad if I lose two mulligans now. Come on. Oh, there's the white land. And uh, the beginning of your combat, if you control another creature of power, four greater, put a one on the counter. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's kill this right now. Kind of risky to play this without like Elsid out because it's the only creature that I have. Forgot about the pump. Yeah, no blocks. Okay, okay. This is. Uh Yeah, I'm stuck on mana. It's not looking all that great. Unless I can get like Hakdos or something. <laughs> and a white land, of course. What's this? Exile target come from opponent's graveyard. Yeah, that's fine. 2-1 flyer. Annoying. This is a solid card. Oh, it's also an uncommon. I never saw this before. Okay, I will hold back. Let's see if this works. Please don't remove this creature. Nice. And this gets now buffed as well because I have a power 4 creature. Timurat, Temple Thief, oh, this can block all day now, but I have Phalanx Tactics, no wait, this gets plus one, plus one, they can double block, this is an enchanted creature, yeah, yeah, I can, Parametra's blessing if they double if they double block. I'm still stuck on freelance. So bad. Uh oh, uh oh. Only Lucky, not touchy.
They don't attack? Oh, I thought it was my turn already. Okay, they attack. And keep Timurad back. So I take four, go down to eight. Kind of no blocks. Let's see if I block here. Not sure if I win the race. Let's block. I'm 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 not confident that I will win the race. Exile target creature. Okay. So hexproof and indestructible. Yeah. So I will do that, right? Hexproof. It's nice. That's why Karamedra's Blessing is so good. It counts like every removal. Come on, I need a land. Please. Timurat can gain life, two life, well, a lot of life. Oh, what's this? Plus two, minus one, and they attack, and go down to four. Uh, I have lethal? Right? Oh no, I forgot about... Oh, the life gain. I forgot about the life gain. Oh no. <sighs> okay, that was stupid. Oops. Good game. I said it earlier that I... I'm so stupid. I said earlier he can gain life. But for some reason I thought it was only sorcery speed. Let's think about this for a second. Can, could I have won this somehow? Yeah, just attack. Play Elsid and get life as a block. Yeah. Uh, that was... That was a uh, thrown away game. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I um, even said there's again only two lands. I even said um, he can gain life, and it, seconds later, I already forgot it. So, please play a creature with two toughness. So good. Now a land, please. Oh, so good. Ah, that's sad.
they take the surge, right? Wait, what did it? They took the Sentinel's eyes? That doesn't make any sense, does it? Oh, because next turn it gets exiled. Oh, uh, or this turn. But that still still seems kind of odd. Um, I didn't understand that at all. Is it worth it to sacrifice the token here? To get more damage in? I think it might be worth it. I think I got way more damage in this way. Frill, Omen, okay. Ah, uh, that sucks. Unfortunately, this doesn't do anything, and I... Target creature... Oh, wait a second. Yeah, I can put this on here and kill this. <laughs> <laughs> Special tricks. Uh, unfortunately, I could have killed this now. Okay. Come on, I. Okay. Um, I should be able to find another creature, please. Hakdos, Hakdos, please, from the top. No, 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 not two lands. Oh, I'm glad I sacked this here. Oh, do I have too few creatures in my deck? Unbelievable. 
The last game I threw away. Oh, this is a very good card. Uh, the last game I threw away. And this game I'm just unlucky here. Oh, come on! Oh! Good game. Five life. I was so aggressive and then they killed all my creatures. They had too much removal. Come on, I, I said this is a free win deck at least. I haven't seen even Hactus once. Come on, I, I want to play Hactus at least once. Because I haven't played with him in Constructed. I want to at least play with him in Limited. Yeah, I think I keep. I'll say turn one, Omen, hopefully turn two. Green, blue, carrioted. Hakdos! There he is! I just need white mana. Okay, I think I kill the ramp. And fixing. Tank for one. Oh, that's this card again. Oh no! Hack toss. Uh, I think I just scry here to f to to find the white land. <laughs> and win with Hack toss. Come on. Sure. This has trample. Okay. Sure. 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 Come on, white land. <sighs> but I can't say no to this one. Maybe this gets some removal here as well. Flash flying, sure. Can't do anything about that. At least I gain one life. No, I can't. Oh, this sucks. I didn't expect this flash flyer here. Oof. Wait. Ah, oh, he doesn't attack with both? Um, sure. Let's kill this. I could. He, I think he didn't read the card. <laughs> oh no! Okay, but Heroes of the Revel is also good. Reading the card explains the card. Yes. Okay, let's let's see. If at the beginning of combat on your turn. Okay. Next. Attack. Please removal so that you don't have removal for Hactus. I should have played Heroes of the Revel. 
Oh no, and finally I can play Hakdos and it doesn't do anything. So I can play Sentinel Eyes and this guy. But I still win, right? I don't think they can do anything about that. Yeah. Whew. Uh, one, but without Hakdos, it's a sad victory. <laughs> okay, I need the third win, please. That was my prediction. I want this to happen. Sure, keep. This is Hakdos mana. <laughs> Ooh, now I draw a little bit too many lands. Please play s s er, the Hound. <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. Am I... Um, This has flash. Okay, so... Next. <laughs> uh. I can see the future, I'm a sage. So Boros against Boros, that's very interesting. Yeah, if it has you know, if he has a combat trick, I'm happy to get it out now. Ooh. Okay. I think I'd rather play Heroes of the Revel. Where's Hakdos? Oh, I draw too many lands now. Does it matter? That's too free. Four nine. That's not lethal yet. Oh wait, I if I targeted maybe it was lethal. I'm not sure. But I can scry too, it's fine too. Why, why didn't they block the Cyclops with a 1-1 token here? Oh, you also gained two life. I didn't know that. Oh, were they out of man? 
No, I'm, I'm confused. Okay. Hakdos? Oh, Heroes of the Rebel again. I don't think I want this though. So... I want this here. I have four, five, six, seven mana, so I can do both Heroes of the Revel and Phalanx Tactics if needed. Ooh. Okay, I will... Uh, I think this is lethal, right? Uh, this doesn't probably matter. Ah, uh, okay. Heroes of the Revel is a really cool card in Boris Agro here. I like it. I was happy to open that many. Furious Rise just doesn't do anything. And I think Triumph of Annex is a pretty solid card. I, I don't know why they say it isn't. Uh, can this block? This was another card that can't block. Oh, no, it only attacks each each combat if able. That was the thing. Um, doesn't matter because I will ex uh, destroy this. So... Yeah, next turn I can fight something. Mm hmm. Sure. Yes. Do I win? Do I win? Oh, I don't. Okay. Six life and I'm out of... So, Hakdos, please. This is exactly... My opponent has exactly six life. <laughs> oh, no! They can gain life now. Wow! Now they're p getting the big stuff out and I'm drawing the lands. No! Ugh. Unbelievable. Do I lose this again? I was so close to victory again. Wow, how many Sage Hounds, uh, Rage Hounds do they have? I'm not say, saying Sage Hounds because... Um, <laughs> because I said earlier that I'm a Sage. Come on, I want to at least cast Hakdos once. I mean, resolve at least once. Oh my goodness. They gain life and this is now a 4-4 flyer. This can block this. Um, yeah, so as this will die to the Archon anyway, I will just block 
and kill this this one here and gain more life oh my goodness and they draw a card there's Hakdos but it's too late right Uh, how many? Three other cards? I, I have no idea what I... Exile here, does it even matter? Pass the turn. <laughs> uh, this can't attack now. Yes. Am I dead? I'm still exactly dead. That's unbelievable. Nothing has reached and this... Yeah, good game. Uh, stupid. <laughs> right? I can't. Unbelievable that I still lost this game. Yeah, that was the draft. I think to the end. Oh, I got two boosters. That was worth it for sure. So at the end, let's go to collect the rewards. Uh, I will get his punishment. Sure. Not excited about that. And I will get Helios intervention. Fine. But I will, let's open eight packs. A mythic wild card. That's awesome. And a rare wild card. Awesome. I take it. A Heliod's intervention. Not excited about that. Uh, oh, I should have said what I want. I want uh, Shadow Spear. I have none. And I want Polochronos because I have none. And um, I want both for my... Uh, both are in consideration for my Brawl deck for the tournament. Oh, Kraken I like. But... Uh, unfortunately, not Shadow Spear, no Polochronos. Hippocamp is not a good card, I think. That is sad. New, I, I, there's an uncommon I didn't open yet. Wow. Oh, a Scryland. Awesome. I'm happy to open that in booster because I don't want to wrap pick uh, Scrylands in draft. Yes, there's the Shadow Spear. Woo! And last pack, Polukranos. Not a Nadia Kraken. So if we go into the decks collection, see what we got new. Sentinel Eyes, this was from the draft. Phalanx Tactics, Revoke Existence, Birth of Melitus, Transom Envoy, Dreadful Apathy. Okay. This was all from the draft. Shadow the Sky. I Shadow the Sky was from my first draft. I have four Krakens now, two Hippocamps, Thassa, now I have four Grey Merchants of Asphodel, Garys, this is the fourth Underworld Breach, this was this funny story in the first draft, uh, pack one, pick one was uh, Underworld Breach, which I just rare drafted. This was the fourth one right after I made the video where I need the fourth one for, for my deck. <laughs> That's the funny story. Uh, Storm Herald. God, lots of new cards. Arasta was also for my other draft. Fire 
third Hakdos. This first Shadow Spear is amazing. Okay, that was it. Okay, so thanks a lot for watching. Uh, next video will likely be again a deck tech. Until next time, bye. Thanks for watching this episode. Check out these links here and also in the video description. Subscribe and follow if you want to be updated for future videos. Thanks for watching. Until next time, bye.